According to WHO, climate change is the single biggest health threat facing humanity. The effects of climate change have been evidenced through natural hazards such as landslides, floods, droughts, heat waves, and the gradual degradation of the environment. In Nigeria, the impact of climate change is reflected in the economy and the environment. It is seen in the desertification of land, which in turn results in land conflicts between herders and farmers, flooding and high temperature, amongst other factors. The adverse effects can be felt in many areas, including agriculture and food security, biodiversity and ecosystems, water resources, human health, human settlements and migration patterns, and energy, transport, and industry. This subsequently affects the livelihood of communities, especially farmers, poor households, and families dependent on natural resources for survival. A recent report by the United Nations Development Programme on the link between gender and climate change revealed that 80% of those displaced by the climate crisis are female. That is, for every impact of climate change, there is a burden for women and girls to bear. Women are usually responsible for water collection in most households and are likely to source water from unsafe, contaminated sources during water scarcity. This can lead to waterborne diseases such as diarrhea. They may also prioritize water for more important activities such as cooking and drinking and neglect proper hygiene, which can result in water wash diseases such as scabies and trachoma. Women are often responsible for household food production, family health and nutrition, all of which are threatened by climate change. In developing countries, women farmers account for 45% to 80%, two-thirds of the female labor force, and 90% of women in many African countries are engaged in agricultural work. The African Development Bank, AFDB, reported that Nigerian women make up 70% of the agricultural workforce. And according to the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development, women account for 75% of the farming population in Nigeria. Due to climate change, food sources become scarce and unpredictable, and women experience loss of harvest and income. Increase in prices make food inaccessible to the poor who are mostly women and children. Women suffer more from macro and micronutrient deficiencies, especially during their reproductive years, which has long-term effects on their health and subsequently negatively impacts the country's socio-economic development. These effects are further worsened by the social, economic and political barriers women face. There is a low representation of women within the policy-making sphere. According to the National Bureau of Statistics, men constitute 94.71% of the national parliament. To mitigate the effects of climate change, it is critical for the rights of women to be regarded in terms of food security, access to resources and participation in decision-making. Women's needs, roles, knowledge, and practices should be accounted for in technological developments in relation to climate change. Training and skill development should be made accessible to women as an initiative to tackle climate change. Women are not adequately represented in decision-making on environmental governance, and the government needs to include gender-sensitive perspectives into policies plans and measures towards sustainable development and climate change.